Good morning on Tuesday. Yes, Chin Chin. Mm. I'm actually having breakfast today in the anticipation of being out for most of the day. In the anticipation of my sister wanting to go shopping after hopefully getting her second negative because she's had COVID. And she messaged me last night going like, <laughs> shopping and I'm like yes get your second negative and let's go shopping so fingers crossed for today so I am having breakfast I'm having two slices of ketogenic toast one with butter and one with crunchy peanut butter which is my favorite so that's lush I've just got um, a couple of things to package up this morning nothing huge because I did didn't have a good day on the eBay yesterday, but that's like I've explained previously, not so bad right now coming up to the end of the tax year. Mm. Anyways, I'm gonna eat my toast. Oh, and you know, I was saying about um, the depleted like salts and waters and being dehydrated and stuff. Well, yesterday's day of rehydration and resalting by use of um, those drops and peanuts and things like that um i am now replenished and i put a pound back on but that's how it goes isn't it i know that that's a pound of water rather than a pound of fat you know ah. but yeah i'm gonna eat my toast mm. okay so just quickly do some sales two lots of Two kilogram bags of jewelry, fifteen ninety nine, including post. Um, three big flower brooches went for eleven ninety nine. This little bunny ring, seven pounds fifty, and um, some Jackie Sabral, sorry Jackie Brazil Sabral, clip on earrings, seventeen pounds fifty nine. And then going over to Canada, um. They treated themselves to a lovely bracelet from my store, but I've already packed it up. Yes, it's going over to Canada, but they have a YouTube channel, which I will link underneath here. Um, it's called Alex Alice Ops, so Alice O-P-S. I'm not sure how if that's pronounced correctly, Alice Ops or Alice O-P-S or... Mm -hmm. Um, but yeah, over in Canada, lots of thrift stores, um, like finds and estate sale finds and things like that. Absolutely delightful. Go and check her out. Yay. Right. My sister has had her second negative test. So hopefully we shall be heading out soon. Yay. No, you will Here with my sister. Yay. She's wearing mask. I will put on my mask soon. We're here at Sandville, which is like um, hospice care, but not really. Look at the view. It's a, honestly, this is the nicest place here. And they've got um, porter cabins full of stuff to buy. So that's what we're going to do.
Well, Sandville was um, a bit... Uh, neither of us bought anything, which is a bit weird. Um, you what? Think we could do this in an hour? Yeah, we could do this in an hour. So now we've come um, yeah, to Port Albert. Sunny, lovely Port Albert. Near the Tata Steel Company. Um, and we're going to do the charity shops here instead. In an hour. So I haven't spent that much. I bought like one necklace and a brooch. What about you, Kate? Um, a few bits and pieces. Just a few. Just a few. As in two bag for life full of China, but there we are. Good China day. It's for the Jubilee party. <laughs> it's for the Jubilee party, obviously. And not to put in one of the many sheds forever. <laughs> Back in Bridgend now, we've just been into the Bar Place charity shop and um, just filled up the jewellery bits and stuff. So there we go. Um, and now I'm going to have fun going to the dentist yet again. So I'll see you after. I'm back home. I am. With a numb face, but I bought a duck. I bought a duck that opens up. He's an open up duck. Oh, Isn't that's he cute. lovely? So <laughs> I love the face on it. He's adorable, isn't he? Yeah. All of this side is numb and my tongue, so that's great. It's like for. Um, like a trinket dish or something. Trinkets. Isn't it? But and, and it's a sort of a man's thing because it's wood. It's a little quacker. Um, a box of jewellery for a fiver, but um, I don't think there's anything particularly exciting. There's two exciting-ish exciting things in there, but only because I bought them and put them in there. Well, she put them in there. So I actually spent £6 on this box of jewellery, but a pound of which was on stuff that I chose. If you see what I mean. So I bought, see that tiny little ring, but that's a moonstone. That was 50p. And then there's a brooch in here that was this lady. She was 50p as well. This lady. And then all of that was a fiver. I don't think there's anything. There's nothing particularly exciting in there. No. There's some nice faux pearls and some nice um, bits of vintage things but it's trying to be fire opal but it's not real no opal, it's is glass it? 
so yeah there's nothing no that's nothing nothing exciting in here but you know when they say like oh i kept this aside for you i'm not gonna go like oh no i'm gonna go Just one of these days one of these days it'll be a box of diamonds not really But yeah, lots of faux pearls for me, faux pearly lot. I thought this one had a lovely clasp on it, but sadly broken. But yeah, I'm not going to say no to lots of faux pills. That's quite a nice set though. Nice and heavy. And that's kind of a nice bangle. I might sell that one separately because it's kind of groovy. And then some Primark. And a tin. So there we go. Colonia, Dom, Doma, anyway. So that's that, a duck and a tin of jewelry. For a certain um, Mr. Jordan Clapham, hello. I got I got two presents. You might have seen them already. Well, you would have seen them already. Disney Paladone. I got you a mug with a little Dalmatian on, and then this little thing. Because. He's got a. This is. These are for Jordan because he's got a Dalmatian. Oh. So I saw them. And I thought, oh, oh. you can have them. I'm not going to leave them because they're cute. I got. Um, it's a Monet box, but the the jewelry inside is not Monet. But I paid four pounds for this insane set of jewelry. It's unfortunately not signed, but. It's bonkers and there's um, matching earrings like wowza so there mum's already not interested um, for a pound each these two brooches that is not the Leostine one, it's the fake ones that you can get off Amazon. I've had Leostine before. Um, you have to be a Leostine seller on eBay, you have to be allowed by the Leostine um, um, company estate to sell her stuff, even even if it's signed Leostine and everything, like you will get kicked, your listing taken down. And I know that from experience. So that is just a brooch that I bought because it's a cat. <laughs> and then there's that one, stainless steel with abalone in it, 1970s. A crazy pair of clip-on earrings. Look at them. Aren't they bonkers? So they'll go like, like that. Actually, let's do it. Come on, get on my ear. That's bonkers. Bonkers clip-ons. And then this pearly one, right, it says MJ, Michael Jackson on the clasp. It's sterling silver with these pearls. So it's pink. Spent £3.50 on that. Was there anything else? There's that in the box. I'm sure I had some other little bits, maybe. Or did I? Did I dream it? No, maybe that is it. That's a pack of cards. That's some tissues. That's another pack of cards. That's my keys. That's my scarf. That's a bag. Yeah, that's it. So there's only one more thing. And that's a bit of Disney. But it is the Napier Magic Carpet. And I think that's quite the collectible. So yes, Aladdin's magic carpet. I think I looked it up and someone in America is trying to sell one for $77, something like that. Anyway. So there we go. 
I've done some done some time in the charity shop. I sorted some more stuff out for them and put some more stuff. And did I buy anything from there today? No, I don't think I did. But I got a duck. And he's my favourite thing that I bought today. Quack. So there, I'm gonna have my co oh, try and have my coffee without spilling it down my numb face. Right, gonna sit down and eat me dinner for tonight. So a bunch of green beans, some cauliflower rice. This is this is a five percent minced beef with some ooh, steam, with peppers and onions and tomato puree and spices and stuff. And on the side, I've got a bunch of pork crunch to kind of dip in me beef. <laughs> nice. I'm having the same pudding as yesterday, but in reverse. Mad world. Chin chin, I'm having some coffee, a decaf, and uh, yeah, that's me done for the day. Tomorrow will be a listing day. I've got to do some work at some point, haven't I? So yeah, I'm going to do listings tomorrow. That's Wednesday, Thursday. I don't know. Friday, I don't know. Actually, Friday, my new laptop comes. Um, and then the weekend, I'm going down to Bristol. Yay. So, um, I shall see you later on in the week with something. I don't know what. But um, that's what the inside of my mouth looks like. Bye-bye now. Bye-bye.